What's up, guys? It's your boy Chum to the game here, back with my Rory McIlroy PGA Tour, and you'll see we'll be ready to do the Peach Invitational at East Le East Lake in Atlanta, Georgia. And coming off the Players Championship, I know I won that because I shot a 59 while Rory shot a 66. I don't care what the game says, I won that. Anyways, we'll go into the Peach Invitational see if we can't get it every yet. All right, back in quick rounds, so that means we only have certain holes we work with. And rounds be done much faster. And Chan EA Sports, in association with the PGA Tour, proudly presents the season long race for the FedEx Cup. Today, it's live opening round coverage of the Peach Invitation. Five strokes off. Hello, everybody. I'm Rich Lerner. And beside me is my friend and colleague, Frank Nabolo. We're here in the state of Georgia getting ready to kick off the round here at East Lake Golf Club. It's been a permanent home to the Tour Championship since 2005. Golf course today set up as a par 70 for the professionals, usually a par 72 for the members. I'm excited to call all the action out on the course for you today. Hey, I shot off the lead. This is a really take good par shot. four. Dog guys. leg to the left, 430. All right, guys, let's take our first shot here on this course, see what we can do. I don't particularly care for this course because I've had a few test runs. And I'm not liking it so far. Here it goes. Alright, straight ahead. It's one of these dog leg holes, and I cannot stand dog leg holes for reasons you guys will see soon enough. Two seventy five, not too shabby right now. Now with the approach here at the par four seven. Probably gonna go a little less club. One more club, actually, just to get it out of the out of the uh, bunker area, just to ensure we get it on the green, get it closer. Get about right there, so I'm going to hit it a little less than 87 yards. A little less than that. So with seven irons, I can actually get it straight to the green over the bunker trap. Frank, I else. think that's going to the bunker. Looks like it. No, nah, just on that the tip like of the road. looks like a miss hit. Frank, the lie was okay. It's a little surprising. Maybe wrong club. Not Set to go. Club. Not an easy shot by any means. Wasn't the wrong club at all. I just happened to hit the uh, wrong part of the rough. That's all. But wow, I managed to recover and get a break. Shot. What are the chances of making it from there? It's gonna be prodigy, man. Well, Frank, we've made it through the sixth unscathed. Here we are at the seventh hole, and a little movement to this par four goes to the left. Exactly, the first Smack hole that one. actually shapes that way at East Lake. Uh, there's one bunker down the left side, that short bunker not in play. Uh, you would think you'd want to draw it off this tee, but really the best access to this undulating green is down the right uh, side. Oh, God. Now, this is not left, hitting in the left, right left, 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 left. Looks like oh, it's going to be in the rough. No. Not on the fairway here. This could be a tough shot coming up next. I hit 300 yards, Second but I hit shot it in the wrong coming out of the place. rough here. Gotta clear these trees out. I don't even know where the ball is. Okay, here it goes. I don't know what good this will do. Probably got a tree on the way up. Yep, got the leaves. So the second of the par four goes begging and now I'll have to rely on the short game. Yeah, but a short game, as we all know, can uh, redeem a lot of mistakes. Let's see if he does it here. Okay, here it goes. Probably can't get a birdie from this position. That should be pretty good right there. On the same side. Easy far. Oh, can't hide the flag stick from that man. Hell of a recovery that was. Been pretty good all day from this distance, just trying to take care of business. Let's hit this and move on. And of course I hit it. What a par save. Solid par to remain one under. And I can keep that up and get some more birdies and possibly well, eagles. Well, Frank, let's see if our gamers taken. have enough muscle to get home here. 600 yard par five. What do you think? I know I can. <clears throat> All right, here goes. I know I don't like this course, but yeah, beggars can't be choosers. And the fairway gets a good spin on that ball. 
300 plus on its own. I'm loving that. Holy shit. 350. Frank, they say you have to ride the wind. Boy, he got all of that one. Got every ounce out of the conditions. Second shot. 350, man. Insanity. That was 350, brother. 350. This one looks like it might have a postage stamp on it. Airmail City. Yeah, look at it. Ah, it Frank landed it on the green. It was never going to stop. No, no chance. Just trying to make clean contact from the rough. Yeah! In the hole. Just a sensational that shot was right sensational! Birdie and Eagle, this is what I'm talking about. This is why I'm so dangerous. Out the front side, and Frank, here we are at last at a par five. And what are we looking at? A good yeah. chance here for the long hitters to drive it down there as far as possible. The hole really board. gives into a nice draw off the tee. One of the reasons why you get that extra kick and bound down the hill, because that's the way the hole shut. Well, when he goes after it like he is here. Look at that. Boom! That is burning through the atmosphere. Look at that thing. It's got a tail on it. That's like a rocket ship. That one was launched by NASA. That was a bomb. Too bad I didn't get an albatross. It'd be like a double -inch. In the fairway here at the tenth, nice way to start off the back nine. Getting set now for the approach here at the tenth. A good drive down the left side um, looks nicely at this green, but the green pitches from that back right to the front left. You can use the slope to your advantage. All right. Here it goes. Let's see what we get here. Holy crap, that's easy. Chance for I would have loved for beautiful shot. Eagle, but I'll take that. Sure. Don't even really have to move this. Here we go. To go four under. And I got it. Of course I got it. You get Too the easy. sense now with now that, in second place. that our young star so explosive is setting himself up for a big weekend run. Damn right. After being... After Moving on now to the 11th, board. and another par 3, second. Frank, this Whoa. one just under well, 200 yards. It does play I a little bit uphill, and uh, really Anyways, it's like a V-shaped green. Uh, those two front bunkers really pitch the front of that green in. Hole actually gets a little easier the further the, the flag goes up the green. It's a little wider, and the chances of having an uphill putt increase. All right, guys. I was robbed of the flare champ because they said Rory beat me. But I know I shot better than him, so this is my chance to... Make up for that uncrowned world championship. Uncrown of that championship. Let's get this par three. Possibly three. Don't hit too hard now. That's on a seed. Slow down. Good looking ball. shot right here. Early part of this back nine and a good approach shot. Now we'll have this for Birdie. Settles in over the putt. 19 inches or 19 feet downhill to the Ah. Uh, a little bit of a spin there. Let's move it to the left. Let's give it a little for push. May not be able to make this birdie. Oh, I hit it a little too hard. Okay, let's we'll scramble for par. There's an opportunity wasted. You shut up. Just knocking him for a par, and let's forget about this one. Um, golf is not about perfect, but it is going to hurt the course. Should have been an easy birdie, but I missed it. But it's okay. It happens. Be the best of us, just well, like Frank, that. Frank, it's our job to get excited. That you can't, the one you time can't where leave it short, though. I'm sad. He's making my job hard. That was the one time where I should have given an extra juice. I didn't, and now I dropped a shot. That's okay, though. Minus three now for the round. Minus three is okay. Now to the par 4 12th. It's only 391 yards, so Frank, uh, where could a player run into some trouble here? It's actually the green here, Rich. Um, the whole hole slopes downhill, and when you look at the second shot under this green, it looks like it pitches back to front. Oh, that sounded like a candle. 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 That
300 plus. All right. That is tasty looking right there, Frank. Just a perfect spot in the fairway. That is prime real estate. How do you get a line like that? Seriously, you could hit any club from there. All right. Let's see if we can get the shot close to the green. Close to the stick. There we go. I want it nice and close to the flag. That's an outstanding shot right there. And it sets up a really good look at birdie. Not a gimme, but well within his range. A little curveball. Here we go. Oh, come on. Wow, that was so close, Frank. Should've it's got time it to forget that one. I mean, he couldn't hit Should've that much better. Should've got a little better. closer on that, on, that, uh, on that approach shot. There we go. Three under for the first round, it's a-okay. Frank, a solid par right there, maintains his position. All right, we'll see what the second round brings us. That's the end of round one, and we saw a lot of good golf out there today, Frank. And it was a bonus to uh, anyone that got off to a good start today. Hmm. Ball striking up 72. Oh, wow, we're second. All right. Second. I like that. So based on the attributes, they put a second for the second round. Sweet. I'm loving that. Yeah, boy. Second place for the second round. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. We'll get started for the second round in just a moment. Okay, I thought I said we were second in the second round. We were actually sixth, but still four under. And in the sixth hole on the second round, let's do this. We already arrived at one championship. We're not going to be arrived at finishing well on this one either. NBC Golf Channel on EA Sports, in association with the PGA Tour, proudly presents the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today, it's live second-round coverage of the Peach Invitational. Located in Atlanta, Georgia, the East Lake Golf Club is the home course to the legendary golfer Bobby Jones. It's the oldest golf course in the city of Atlanta. This is Rich Loner along with Frank Novello for EA Sports, and we'll be calling all the action out on the course today. Looking for a little vengeance here, guys. Vengeance! See, shot even for right now, but the leaders aren't too far behind. They are all in a Five-way tie for first. This 209-yard par three is really an intimidator, especially with a prevailing wind. Okay, guys, we're the co-leader. Let's see if we can add on to that lead. Headed into the rough there. There it goes. All right. Keep it the fairway. Ah, too much he pays a price for that. Yeah, when you don't see the top of the ball in the rough, you know it's not sitting pretty. Gonna need a bit of force to extract one out of there. Too much bounce. Not terrible, but not his best. Yeah, outside chance, really, for uh, for Birdie, but um, really, uh, it was a, a rather poor approach shot. Why don't you try to make a shot from out there? Always two components to the long lag putt, the speed, number one, and then the read. And missed out on that second part. Oh, it was cruel. That looked like it was certainly going <clears throat> in. Okay, so lose a shot. I'm Settles in over the putt.
Uh, with time running out, Rich, that's what's going to make that bogey sting even more. Can't That'd afford to give him away at this point in the championship. Oh, yeah. It was only a one stroke. Ooh, look drop. at this, Frank. 600 yard par five here at the Kinda ninth. Making it's tasty. Down this you'd think you'd just comfortably smash a drive <laughs> over there and reach it in two. Sometimes it works out that way. But they just put a little lake that comes across and that cuts in the fairway. So if you have hit an errant tee shot, uh, you might have to make um, a decision. Well done there. Oh, well, this looks good. It certainly is. It just rolled down that hill and it's going to keep on rolling on it. Three fifty. That is a fantastic long shot. There's no way he could hit that without a tail breeze. Surely that breeze had to help there. Second yeah, from an excellent lie. So you can get it on the on the uh, stick there. All right, here it goes. Gonna give it a little less than full hundred juice. So I can see if I can get it near the flag. Oh, solid strike right in the heart of the green. Oh, damn it! That bounce killed me. It was almost like that's what he wanted to do, but why would you want it to run over the back? Yeah, Good thing he stayed in the first there. cut because just a couple of feet over, that rough is really deep. Oh no, look out, Frank. I think he flushed that one. Oh, this is this is going, going, gone. Wow, lucky break right there, Frank. Well, Easy break. Exactly. That's what everyone else is gonna say, except him. Got it. That was a nice birdie, and no doubt he's feeling pretty good about his position on this leaderboard. A series mm -hmm. of good holes in a row has got him to this point. Well, that was a nearly <laughs> flawless performance on the front side, but Frank, we know it's an 18 hole game, isn't it? That's right. Now's not the time to pat yourself on the back. It is. To the right back and spin it out to the left if needed. I won't need it. I'm loving that balance. Well, it is nice to have that one in your bag, be able to hit it that long. Yeah, that has to be at least 315 yards. Frank, this is a position where a player is absolutely licking his chops here. Good chance to make a birdie. Yeah, this is when this game just looks like fun. Bunkers don't seem to be in play. The only thing you're really looking at right now is just the flag. Early part of this back nine done. and a good approach shot. And now we'll have this for birdie. See if he can get something going here. Two straight birdies. Be nice. That would most definitely be nice. Wow, I Ooh. thought he made that. Stop rolling ball. Just when you think you're going to make birdie. Now have to really concentrate on this and at least make pop. Well, it's at sneaky distance. Can it already rolled too far. Twenty footer. Nope. You know, for such a strong man, weak pop. Now I'll have to make this just to avoid making Michael Dublé. All right. I think I the shot back at Scott. So, probably best I'll finish that if he's tied to the floor. Uh, away with a bogey. One down. It's fine now. Moving on now to the 11th and another par three. Frank, this one just under 200 yards. Does play a little bit uphill and uh, really it's like a V-shaped green. <clears throat> uh, those two front bunkers really pitch the front of that green in. Hold actually gets a little easier the further the, the flag goes up the green. It's a little wider and the chances of having an uphill putt increase. No problems there. Really good approach shot. Now, good looking birdie. Second shot. 15 footer. It's like a straight ahead shot. Maybe a little to the right. Give him a little extra juice just to be safe. Take a shot. Got it! 
And I got my birdie back, so I'll finish in a tie for first. Yet another birdie, and Woo. yet another tie at the top of the leaderboard. Uh -huh. So all the scores have been posted for Good round stuff. number two, and look who is on top of the leaderboard, Frank. Yeah, with two very solid rounds of golf, uh, key right now, just stay out of your own way and keep it up. Uh, the pressure will start to build. We know that as you get closer to the end of this tournament. Let's see what we do at Mason Attributes. All right, so I'm only one under, or one, one behind, heading into the third round. And we'll cover the third round in our next episode. So I hope you all enjoyed the first two rounds of the Peach Invitational, and I will see you guys very soon. It's your boy Chime Sigma signing up. Remember, if you liked this video, be sure to like, smash that like button as fast as you can, comment, and subscribe to support me on the channel. You guys mean each and everything to me. So, till next time, peace out, everybody.